वन डे मंडे वेंट टू ट्यूजडे टू सी वेनजडे एंड आज थर्सडे टू टेल फ्राइडे एंड सैटरडे दैट संडे इज फन डे लेट्स लर्न डेज ऑफ द वीक देर आर सेवन डेज इन अ वीक दे आर मंडे ट्यूजडे वेनजडे थर्सडे फ्राइडे सैटरडे एंड संडे संडे इज द फन डे नाउ लेट इज राइट दीज डेज ऑन द बोर्ड मंडे एम ओ एन डी ए Y Monday Tuesday T U E S D A Y Tuesday Now Wednesday W E D N E S D A Y Wednesday Next is Thursday T H U R S D A Y Thursday Friday F R I D A Y Friday Saturday S A T U R D A Y Saturday Sunday S U N D A Y Sunday Monday is the first day of the week Tuesday is the second day of the week. Wednesday is the third day of the week. Thursday is the fourth day of the week. Friday is the 5th day. Saturday is the 6th day of the week. And Sunday is the 7th day of the week. Now we already know the days of the week so let us take a small quiz as we all know monday is the first day of the week 
So come on students, answer these questions for me. So tell me, which is the second day of the week? Correct, that is Tuesday. Now say, which is the last day of the week? Saturday? No. Correct, that is Sunday. Very good. Now say, which is the fourth day of the week? That is Thursday. Which is sixth day of the week? Come on. Saturday. Correct answer. The favorite fun day of the week. Which is the fun day of the week? Correct. That is Sunday. Let's take a quiz. The name of our quiz is Before and after. So say, which day comes before Tuesday? Think. Correct. That is Monday. Now say, which day comes after Tuesday? Think and say. Correct. That is Wednesday. Very good. Say, which day comes before Saturday? Thursday? No. Think? Correct. That is Friday. Good students. Now say, which day comes after Saturday? Correct. Sunday. Very nice. Now say, which day comes after Wednesday? Right answer. That is Thursday. Today, yesterday, tomorrow. Today, yesterday, Tomorrow. Today is the present day. Yesterday is the day before the present day. Tomorrow is the day after the present day. So now let's take an example. Suppose today is the Friday. So the day before Friday is Thursday. So on Friday we say that yesterday was Thursday. Day after Friday is Saturday. So on Friday we say that tomorrow is Saturday. Let's take few more examples. Suppose today is Tuesday. So on Tuesday we say that yesterday was 
Monday. Tomorrow will be Wednesday. Suppose today is Saturday. So on Saturday we say that yesterday was Friday and tomorrow will be Sunday. Students, let's take a quiz. Say, what is the day today? Correct, today is Friday. Say now, what is two days after Monday? Two days after Monday. So, after Monday... Tuesday, Wednesday and the answer is Thursday. Two days after Monday, Thursday. Tell me, what is seven days after Saturday? Seven days after Saturday. So, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. So, seven days after Saturday is Sunday. So, tell me, which day was it yesterday? Today is Friday. So, which day was it yesterday? Then can say, correct, yesterday was Thursday. And which day will be tomorrow? Today is Friday. So, tomorrow will be Say, correct, Saturday. Well then students, which day will it be day after tomorrow? So, today is Friday. So, tomorrow will be Saturday and the day after tomorrow will be Sunday. Which day was it day before yesterday? Today is Friday. Yesterday was Thursday. So the day before yesterday was say Correct. Wednesday. Tell me, which is your favorite day and why? Okay, I'll tell you about my favorite day. My favorite day is Sunday. My favorite day is Sunday because Sunday is a holiday and Sunday is also a fun day. Now based on this timetable, I am going to ask you a few questions. Say, on which day we play cricket? Cricket, cricket we play on Sunday. What games do we play on Saturday? Saturday. We play hockey on Saturday. We play basketball after which day? Basketball. We play basketball on Friday. So Friday comes after Thursday. We play football before 
विच डे फुटबॉल वी प्ले फुटबॉल ऑन ट्यूजडे सो ट्यूजडे कम्स बिफोर विच डे टेक अ लुक एंड से वेरी गुड ट्यूजडे कम्स बिफोर वेन इज डे ऑन थर्सडे वी प्ले विच गेम से करेक्ट वी प्ले बैडमिंटन ऑन थर्सडे हाउ मेनी गेम्स डू वी प्ले इन अ वीक कम ऑन काउंट एंड से वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स एंड सेवन सो वी प्ले सेवन गेम्स इन अ वीक All these students are in my class and all of them want to sit on the first bench when I'm teaching. So, I have decided their turn according to the weekdays. Monday is for Anju. Tuesday for Arjun. Wednesday for Gauri. Thursday is for Karan. Friday for Swara and Saturday is for Yash. Based on this timetable, answer my few questions. Whose turn is it on Wednesday? Wednesday, it is Gauri's turn. Whose turn is it before Tuesday? So Monday comes before Tuesday. On Monday, Anju's turn. Yash will be sitting on the first bench. on the day after yash sat on the first bench on saturday so saturday comes after friday karan sat on the first bench on the day before karan sat on the first bench on thursday so thursday comes before which day say correct that is Friday Swara is sitting on Friday so Anju will sit on which day Swara sitting on Friday so Anju look and tell me correct that is Monday very good student let's learn months of the year there are 12 months in a year they are january february march april may june july august september october november and december january is the first month February is the second month. March is the third month. April is the fourth month. May is the fifth month. June is the 6th month. July is the 7th month. August is the 8th month. September is the 9th month. October is the 10th month. November is the 11th month. And December is the 12th month. Based on 
based on the months answer my few questions so tell me which is the first month of the year january january is the first month of the year which is the fourth month of the year look and tell me april is the fourth month of the year which is the last month of the year december is the last month of the year which is the 10th month of the year october october is the 10th month of the year which month comes before may come on students tell me which month comes before may correct that is the month april now tell me which month comes after february after february it is the month march which month comes after july after july correct it is the month august very good students out of all the months july and august are my favorite month because it rains in these months students now tell me which are your favorite months okay write down your favorite months in your notebook and also write why do you like these months students do you know there are 7 months in a year which have 31 days and 4 months which have 30 days so let's write down january has 31 days i will tell you about february after a while the month march has 31 days april has 30 days may has 31 days june has 30 days the month july has 31 days august has 31 days September has 30 days. October has 31 days. November has 30 days. And December has 31 days. Students Let's learn about February. February is the shortest month. It has less than 30 days. February has 28 days, but in a leap year, February has 29 days. Remember students A leap year comes after every 4 years. Now, I'm going to teach you a very simple method to remember which months have 31 days and which months have 30 days. For that, hold your hand like this. There is upper part and there is lower part. Months coming on the upper part have 31 days and months coming on lower part have 30 days so let's find out january february march april may june july august september october november and december
Now students, answer my few questions. So tell me, there are how many months in a year? I had told you earlier. Say, correct, there are total 12 months in a year. How many months have 30 days? Let's count. 1, 2, 3 and 4. So, there are 4 months in a year which has 30 days. How many months have 31 days? Let's count again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. So, there are 7 months which has 31 days. Which month has 28 or 29 days? Correct! Month February has 28 or 29 days. Tell me students, which month comes between March and May? Answer the question. Correct. That is the month April. One more question. Which month comes between October and December? Look and say. Correct. Month November comes between October and December. Very well done students. There is some homework for you. You have to find out names of five vegetables fruits and flowers and the months in which they grow. Make a proper list in your notebook. Match the columns. Students, I have written some festivals in this column and names of the month. Now, help me to match them. Tell me, Makar Sankranti comes in. Which month? Month January. Holy in which month? Month March. Ganesh Chaturthi comes in which month? Month August or September. Diwali comes in which month? Diwali comes either in October or in November. Christmas comes in which month? Correct, month December. Students, now I am giving you some homework. You have to make a list of different festivals celebrated in India and the months in which they are celebrated. Make a list of those festivals in your notebook. Students, I stay in Mumbai. So, I am going to tell you about climatic conditions of Mumbai and the months in which they occur. In Mumbai, the coldest months are December and January. It rains heavily in Mumbai during the months July and August. The hottest months in Mumbai are April and May. Students, there is some homework for you. You have to make a list of regions in India with hottest climate, coldest climate and heaviest rainfall. Do make a list in your notebook. 